in the name of Allah, the most beneficent and the most merciful. Assalamu alaikum and a very good morning to all my dear students. This is your teacher Hina Ahmad Khan from prep class. I hope you all are fine at home and are revising and enjoying all the previous topics that I have taught you in the previous lessons. Today is 17th April 2020 and the day is Friday and the weather is sunny. It's your maths lesson and today in maths lesson I'm gonna tell you more about shapes. As you people know that in the previous two lessons I have told you about the shapes but that were the flat shapes. Today I'm gonna tell you more about shapes and they are 3D shapes. Let's start our lesson. We can see shapes all around us. Shapes, shapes everywhere. It means that if you look around yourself, you, you can see many shapes. So, in the previous two lessons, I told you about the circle, triangle, rectangle and square. These are called flat shapes. But today we are going to learn about the solid shapes. Let's see what are the solid shapes. The solid shapes occupy space. These are also called three-dimensional or 3D shapes. As the first one is cylinder. The second one is cone. The third one is cube and the fourth one is cuboid. These are called solid shapes. They occupy space. We can also call them 3D shapes. Can you guess the name of these shapes? Fantastic. The first one is a cube and it says I am a solid shape and I have six sides. The second one is cylinder and it says I have two circular bases and one curved side. What about these shapes? The first shape is cuboid and it says I have six faces all of them are rectangles. The second one is cone and it says I have a circular face at one end and a point at the other end. Now discuss the name of different shapes with your mom. As you can see many objects on the page. There is a tissue box, an ice cream cone, the packs of chips, there is a block, a dice or a cell. So find out these objects and discuss their shapes with your mom. So this is your written task for today. Now ask your mom to draw the shapes given below on a sheet, paper or any kind of notebook. Do colors in them and write the names of shapes as well. There is a cube, cylinder, cuboid and cone. Then submit your work by 9 p.m. along with your name, class and section. So I'd like to wrap up my lesson by saying that take a round in your house and identify as many solid shapes as you can and tell it to your mother. Thank you. Inshallah, we will see you in the next lesson. Till then, take care of yourself. Allah Hafiz.